now in this series i am starting data analysis in excel so in this channel along with step by step analytics in r studio in python uh, in sas and along with the, that i am starting data analysis in excel excel is very powerful tool for data analysis so today uh, our topic is quartile analysis in this video i'll uh, explain quartile analysis so what is this quartile analysis by quartile analysis we try to understand what is the range of a uh, continuous variable say for example here i have one continuous variable called revenue say for example imagine if here means crores of crores of data you have but you try to understand ki how this data uh, you try to understand uh, the data this particular data so to understand this uh, data uh, we means what is the range of this particular data we can use quartile analysis then we can do percentile analysis so percentile analysis i'll come later so now let's start quartile analysis here i have taken a uh, revenue as a variable and i have taken 100 observations so let's understand what is the minimum value of this particular uh, variable equal to m i n so this is the range of this particular variable and enter so this is the minimum value so now let's understand what is the uh, before we go to quartile let's, let's understand what is the maximum value of this particular uh, revenue variable equal to m a x so this is the maximum value of this um part uh, of this particular variable revenue variable so minimum is 697 and maximum is 19672 okay now let's understand what is the first quartile so equal to quartal e x c we need to take then we need to give the range so here then shift control down arrow comma right <coughs> right now we'll try to understand what is the first quartile so one first bracket close enter so this is the first quartile now second quarter of this particular variable same way quarter then array so before that we need to give comma then second quarter right two then enter so this is the second quartile we can tell it is mode of this particular variable as well now third quartile so later on i'll explain uh, you uh, box plot so over there uh, it would be clear to you when i show you in box plot then third quartile is quartile then range comma 3 enter this is the third quarter <coughs> now inter quarter range 
so inter quartile range it is like between quartile what is the range so this value is actually i'll explain to you when i'll uh, explain to you uh, box plot uh, it would be clear to you but right now uh, for understanding you can formula would be equal to quartile 3 to minus equal to quartile 3 minus quartile 2 so this is inter quartile range and now what is the upper whisker so upper uh, friends sorry so upper friends equal to so third quart quartile plus 1.5 into interquartile range so this is the value and now equal to lower quartile is equal to first quartile minus 1.5 into interquartile range so is equal to first quartile minus 1.5 into interquartal range so let's give bracket over here the last time there is a error had come so yeah so this is the lower friends now let's calculate average and why i am calculating average i'll explain to you uh, when i'll explain box plot equal to a b so average then again we need to select the range of array and this is my average now okay. let's let's see a box plot so let's select this range then so we need to chart from box and whisker so this is the box plot so this is the box plot now <clears throat> so now let's give data level then it would be very much clear to you yeah so this is the data level so let's see if i change format how it would be I think it would be yeah more visible so okay outliers cannot be visible over here so I need to change the format again oh there is no outlier strange <clears throat> so let's understand minimum see 697 697 this is the minimum range of this particular data okay this is the first quartile this is first quartile see it's like a uh, 
quarter so first quarter one fourth so this is the first quartile so here we try we are trying to understand the range of this particular uh, variable 6005 see 6005 second quartile 8710 8710 this is you can say this is the mode so maximum value of this particular uh, this 100 observation maximum value is maximum value is means uh, 8710 maximum time it will come it's like mode and that mean or, or average this is the mean point it is 9856.267241 same this this is the value average value okay and this one is my third third quartile so this is my 12842.25 is my third quartile and inter quarter range is see see this blue area this is inter quarter range so what is the distance between these two okay so this is inter quarter range and yeah and maximum 19672 so this is the maximum see if you see normally what happen in uh, general cases you might see some uh, points over here some points over in this particular region so these points would be outlier but uh, <laughs> this is very strange i am not getting any outlier over here so normally you you will definitely get uh, some outlier when you deal with means huge data okay maybe my observation is very less only 100 observation that is why i am not getting any outliers but still in 100 observation also i should get some outliers but uh, in this area you will get outliers so yeah so hope you understood this video if if you have any questions you can uh,